everybody. Okay, so what I am doing today is I am making a bird feeder. It's a little owl. I got him at Joann's right, or right after Halloween for like 60 cents. But I am going to layer my cups, one for the front and one for the back. I have got parchment that I am putting in there. My colors are kind of bizarre, but I'm trying to use up some stuff that I have little amounts of. So we have got parchments. Then we have cadmium red light hue, which is more orange. And then we are going to do copper. Then black metallic. gold and then some of the light green that I have left over from the rainbow pores like I said it's a weird combo this antique copper so since I have all these birds out here singing to me I figured I might as well give them a little place to come snack even though they drive me insane <laughs> Maybe I'll give it to one of my neighbors and maybe the birds will go over to their house. <laughs> okay. And then I'm going to go back and put a little bit more of each color that I have left. So we're going to do some more parchment. orange Drop of the black. This is more than enough paint, so might only use one of the cups. We'll see. paint everywhere. Okay, gosh, good. I'm gonna 
top it off with just a drop of the gold. There is no silicone in here, but there is silicone in the cup to help release paint. Dirty pour over the top and see what we get. Start on the wing. There's lots of holes, so that's why I have. I should have put a tray underneath it to catch all the paint, but it's fine. We've got cardboard down there. Sorry if that's moving the camera. Hopefully it's staying in focus. Okay. There is one. Do this little guy down here. go ahead and torch them. And I just have his sides painted black. So. Tapping along the areas around his eyes just to make sure it all gets covered. Okay, we'll move on to the little dude, the back side.
should be good. Let me torch it one more time. Okay, so this is his front side. I will go back after it dries and clean up the sides. Make sure it's not too drippy on there. Should be good. And then here is his back side. The back definitely turned out better than the front, but I kind of expected that from all the holes that's in it. But there he is. After he dries, I will put him together and throw him in a tree. Kind of has a camo look to him. Not too bad. Anyways, I hope everybody's having a great day. Thanks for watching.